Farmers in Ontario use incredible technology in the field, but the weight of this equipment can come at a cost. Improper tire pressure and wet field conditions can do deep damage to soil quality and yields for years to come. In September 2017, the Innovative Farmers hosted a full day of field demos, one important piece of the puzzle to solving soil compaction. We're speaking with soil health, it's impossible to not talk about compaction issues and that sort of thing that we have going on in our soils. So uh, soil health has been the basics of where, where Innovative Farmers started from. So we're happy to host Compaction a Day event here at Shaw Ridge Elevators in Arthur. We're very pleased to have almost 400 people in attendance here today. Sensors were placed in the soil at 6, 12 and 20 inches to measure the pressure that equipment creates. Various weights and tire setups drove over these sensors in live testing. So my name is Matthias Stettler. I'm a research fellow at the Bern University of Applied Sciences in Switzerland. In Switzerland, soil protection is a big issue. We have to take care of our soils. We want to protect that soil from being built on and of course we have to avoid soil compaction. I think compaction is important because to me it's acted like a silent thief. We know it's out there but we struggle to know how to deal with it. So as a result of that we've tried to ignore it for so many years and now we've got some of the sophisticated tools that are allowing us to see where it's happening and not just at the surface but through the depth of the profile and so that's allowing us to better understand it. As well as higher technology, uh, inflation pressure, all these types of technologies are coming and the recognition by the industry of the importance of reducing compaction is so important and is becoming something that they want to be involved with too. We're also very proud and fortunate that the local dealer network and the sponsors in the area were fully committed to this event as well. We couldn't have done it without them. There was probably close to 30 sponsors here today. The amount of equipment that we had, all different tire attributes, all different track technologies. It was fantastic that we had as much support um, from outside our organization as we had from inside the organization. So this day is unbelievable in terms of what it means to the Ontario farmer and every farmer needs to take a step back, look at what's happened here and pay attention to how much weight they're, they're putting on the soil, how much air pressure they have in their tires, whether they're using tracks or not. We can do a way better job, but we have to weigh our implements and we have to do the right thing from a compaction standpoint or we're on this treadmill, we're going this way, we're just going to keep going this way if we don't change what we do and that's what this day is showing me. Stay tuned to our website at ifao.com for the results in the fall of 2017.